As a firm that works with employers to recruit talent, for this Black History Month, we explore the ongoing wage gap between Black talent and other populations across North America. Studies have shown that the Black-white economic divide in the U.S. is as wide today as it was in 1968. This was the same year that Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated. In 2019, median Black household wealth in the U.S was $24,100, whereas for white household wealth, it was $188,200. As this disparity has continued, today we see that one in seven white families in the U.S. are millionaires, whereas for black families, it's one in 50. In Canada, disparities are also apparent. According to Statistics Canada, the average income for the Black population in 2016 was $35,310, whereas for non-visible minorities, it was $50,225. In Toronto in 2016, the median annual income for Black men was $13,000 lower and for Black women, $3,400 lower than the rest of the population. In Ottawa Gatineau in 2016, the median annual income for Black men was $23,000 lower and for Black women, $15,000 lower than the rest of the population. Clearly, much more needs to be done to address income inequality. While we cannot change history, it's within all of us to change the future.